Alrighty, welcome to this short video on explaining how to set a VNT setting, a variable VN setting on uh, most turbochargers. One of the things that can happen when you buy a reconditioned turbo is sometimes the position for the VNT may not be set correctly. What we're talking about is this little uh, stop screw here for the VNT lever which is here and you can see that this um, position of this screw will stop the VNT lever at that point but that may not be the correct VN position in the actual turbocharger so one of the things that we can do is if we use the old one when we're putting the uh, when we're rebuilding the turbocharger and check the actual position of the VNT lever by fitting the old one back in and moving the lever to the full boost position which is there and then removing the VNT lever, or removing the actual cartridge from the, the housing and checking the position of the VNs by actually looking inside. Um, we can just, just about see the VNs open. And then what we would do is set the new one accordingly to the position of the old one. Not the same position as this, because you don't know how long this screw is compared to this screw but adjust the new uh, the, the new set cartridge um, so that the veins and the axle housing are in the same position as the old one um, so that's one thing you can do to make sure that you get the correct position um, when you put the turbo back on and the car boosts correctly um, and doesn't overboost or underboost, etc. So, hope that was informative. Just quick, um, just a quick uh, video on that. And um, please leave a comment, hit the like button, ask any questions, etc. Share it on social media. Every little helps. Um, again, thanks for watching, and watch out for more videos.